What do you have to say? Lance Corporal Vatslav. How'd that prick wind up with us? Volunteered. Word is he had to bribe the medics to let him enlist. He mad or what? And that's just it. Certifiably insane. Didn't pass the tests apparently. But to pay hard coin to enter the army? I thought at my age nothing could surprise me. Nothing about the cook. Say. That's a horse for Sylvie. You got a daughter? Why do you ask? Well, think on it. Be marrying to a dynasty like that. It'd be like living in clover. Best in the bedroom. Why the hell not? And only bring trouble, mate. Only trouble. Hmm. Nothing interesting. Your kind spreads disease, defeatism, and desertion. What do you have to say? Mm, fish chowder for supper the day. That true? Who told you? No one. Came through the western gate the morn. Saw Martin on the pier, rod in hand, fishing. Cook like that's a right treasure he is. Cook like that's a right treasure he is. No griping about poor supplies. Just the gumption to enrich our gruel. Nah, uh, aye. If only you'd go a bit lighter on the garlic. Pier near the western gate. Should be easy enough to find. Redania. Long live Rabbit! Must be the cook. Good day, fish biting. Hi there. What about you? What's that? Got this mixture. Pay you to pour it in the soup for the boys of the garrison on my signal. Nothing dangerous about it. Most they'll think is that the fish wasn't exactly fresh. It'll cost you, mate. Something dear. Asking a lot. Too much. How about you do this free of charge, huh? Out of the kindness of your heart. Aye. I'll help. Out of kindness. Wait for the signal. And mum's the word. Understood?
and Countess Yvonne of Lanexeter's necklace. Your handiwork, wasn't it? It was. I scaled a gutter, entered her bedchamber. Ha! <laughs> I knew it, I knew it. Ah! At last, we're all here. Time to begin. This heist is no jest. So if any of you has any doubts, isn't sure, now's the time to leave. Won't be able to after. The Borsodi's auction house, its vault. That's our target. Everline, you'll enter through the tower when the patrol rounds this corner. Drop us a line. We have to be inside within five minutes, is that enough? It's plenty. Splendid. Once we're all in the tower, we'll proceed to the auction house. Shouldn't see any guards inside. If we do, we'll have Geralt and his blades. Then, downstairs to the vault. Quinto will crack the lock. We get in the vault, take the loot, disappear out the back through a secret passage. I've said my piece. Any questions? Hmm. All good and fine, except... What if something goes wrong? Seriously. You're on your own. We all are. Just like that? No room for friendship in this business. Additional security measures. Traps. Any inside? Anything we need to watch out for? Nothing particularly dangerous. Here on the ground floor, there's a rope linked to the bell in the tower. Anyone sounds the alarm, there'll be trouble. How do we stop it from ringing? Don't pull the rope. As I said, the auction house ought to be empty. I don't expect any problems. What about the vault? How is it secured? With a door. But you ought to be able to handle it. Any other problems, we resolve as they come. Anything else? Got a horse sense take on this. Secret passage. If we plan to use it on the way out, why not on the way in? Excellent question. Why not? Every corridor has two ends, right? Like a rope. I know the location of just one end. It's in the vault. The other, it's somewhere beneath the city. But I can't tell you where. Mm -hmm. Great. But if you were to... Find that location, I wouldn't need any of you. Believe you me, I've tried. Time and again. Anything else? All right, let's get to work. Want to be done with this as soon as possible. We'll reconvene in the gateway beside the tower. Midnight sharp. And everyone's to make sure they're not followed. I'll get word to the cook in the barracks. What about wearing masks? Not a city in the north that don't have wanted posters with my likeness hanging about. I'll tend to that. Ah, one last thing. Inform the city watch. Blabber anything about this over a nail. And I'll kill you. With me own hands. If you're so damned scared somebody will talk, let's all go there together. Now. Any objections? Anyone need more time? On our way, then. Let's begin. Prime. Just one patrol. Mixture of yours must have worked. Eveline, you ready? Are you kidding? Of course I am. Three, two, one. your way. Plowing city foul shite all over again. What? Patrols oh, so. turn. 
turning round. We've one minute. Move. Hilma Letale, hallowed mother, keep us from. Serves. You assured us there be no one inside. Seems my informer was wrong. Is that all you've got to say? I nearly broke my neck. You knew what you were signing up for. This is no time to argue. Gotta agree. Backing out's not an option anymore. Need to see this through, whatever happens. Hallowed words. One guard could mean many more. You'd best draw your sword now. No. What now? No one dies. Said so from the start. Whatever. Don your masks and let's go. must be old. String seems to say so too. Clear for now. Knock on wood. Good. Eyes in the back of your heads, everyone. Mine are open. I've already seen several things I'd gladly take with me. No. Yes, but we shall raise the starting pro Watch this! Guards! Guards! I should have stayed in that cage. You said... I damn well know what I said. At them before they sound the alarm. Your mum smells of gooseberries! <laughs> 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 to flee! Lock themselves in. Bollocks! Damn it. Lay down your arms! You have no chance! Perhaps not. <laughs> but we do have hostages. Mercy, master! On the count of three, we go in! One! Two! 
Come one step closer and folk will die. Hold now! We must negotiate. What are your demands? To release the hostages? Buy us a bit of time, Geralt. We have one demand. Pull back from the auction house. You know I cannot do that! You can. Just not sure you want to. How about I help you decide? Kill a hostage. Just do what they want! I beg you! <laughs> Calm yourself! No one is to be harmed, clear? Nothing simpler. So long as you take your boys and pull out, we'll all live happily ever after. I repeat, that is not an option. We must bargain, reach an agreement. So we want a wagon, and horses. It's the middle of the night. Where am I to find a wagon? Rather go looking for caskets? <laughs> he means it! Your point. A wagon, then? What kind? Time he took a gander downstairs. Vaults open. Radovid's coronation carriage. Nothing less. Drawn by two snow-white mares. Do you think the situation is jest? Do you? Ah, no! You're both right! This is no jest! I want us to reach an agreement. I don't want anyone to get hurt. But you must not ask the impossible! Second time you're turning me down. Shit negotiation tactic. It seems the negotiation's not my strong suit. Nor is it yours! Attack! Oops. Tip the scales. Splendid job you did there. Witcher, not your negotiator. Where's Eveline? She's fled. All the better. Fewer hands reaching out for loot. Come on before reinforcements arrive. Lovingly crafted. Two spring-loaded bolts, cylindrical plugs, dimeritian wards. I'm not interested. No one's interested. We go in. Geralt, you're at the fore. Why me? It's why I hired you. Now move, with no time. Mm -hmm. Do or die. Excitement. 
themselves in. You don't know who you're fucking with! On the contrary, I know all too well. Yeah, you all? Greetings, brother. Been years. Well, well. Complications, complications. Should have known. Same eyes, same double chin, same rotten heart. Just one question. This family reunion? What's the point? Revenge. For betrayal. Years of poverty. Humiliation. Father left the auction house to me in his will. Horst cheated me. Had me disinherited. Anything. Everything we earned, you squandered on cards and whores. Father didn't see that. I did. That's no excuse, Horst. And it won't save your life. You two, stand with me. I'll not let the Redanians lay a hand on you. Give you whatever you want. A desperate attempt at bribery going once, twice, thrice. Hmm. No takers, no sale. Speak for yourself. Tempting offer. I've succumbed. You'll pay for that, Quinto. With your head. At them! I'd have preferred to resolve this elsewise. Stolen the scrolls, thrown you out into the street. Revenge is best served cold, after all. But I don't mind serving it hot. No. I beg you, mercy for your brother. I shall do anything you ask. Truly. Anything. Sign over to me all that you own. Then walk out as you stand with just the clothing on. Allow me one thing, any one thing. Fifteen years. 
in the sewers. Like a beast, and you've the cheek to plead. Satisfied? Exceptionally. You? No, and I won't be until I find Max Brasotti's house. In this vault, or so you said. And it is. There. But I fear it's not yours for the taking. You see, it houses my father's will. A scroll thanks to which Ewald Borsoldi, long missing, will assume the family. Fortune. And Geralt of Rivia, who you cheated, what'll he assume? Alas, but he's free to choose anything else. Don't provoke me. Never know. Might choose to take your head. You're wounded. Tired. Figure my chances are good. Hmm. <sighs> Dumb. But have it your way. Let's make this quick before the soldiers get down here. At your service, mate. Damn candles. <sighs> Redanians will be here soon. Damn it, secret passage, where is it? through the cracks. Passage must be here. Now how do I open it?
Nick of time. Now to get out of here. Dania. So bored I could spew. <laughs> How much for a herring? Crown a piece. Huh? I'll wait for it to drop. My valor stands on three pillars. Need to chat. I'm all ears, Witcher. Got something for you. I love gifts, but I prefer to unwrap them in private. Oi, lads, mind the barrels. Going out for a jabber with Geralt. Come. That's better. All right. What do you have for me? Max Persodi's house, as requested. Ah, Horst must be livid. He's not. No? He's not anything except dead. His brother, same thing. A few others, too. Stones you've got. But I didn't think you'd have the stomach for a massacre. Situation got out of hand. 
<laughs> oh, sounds familiar. There you are, drinking, puffing on henbane, and then, surprise, heads rolling across the floor. And none know how or why. I'm not amused. No? Why not? Because unlike you, killing gives me no pleasure. The boss orders aren't worth your tears. Sons of bitches to a man. The Borsodis. What's your gripe? Get kicked out of an auction? Worse. They evicted me from my home. Are you really interested? Wouldn't have asked if I wasn't. Ha! <laughs> Cheeky as ever. My family. They took on some debt. A poor investment in a sawmill. A bad crop one year. A lawsuit lost. You know how it is. When it rains, it pours. We needed but a few weeks to recover. But Horst Borsodi had acquired our debt. All of it. Demanded it be repaid immediately. I pleaded. I begged. I tore open my shirt at his threshold. Ugh. It was like talking to a wall. I went to the auction. Saw those perfumed pricks by my father's sword. My mother's death mask. My brother's horse tack. Ah, Horst earned a pretty pile selling our mementos. No surprise the animosity you feel for him. That was but the start. My Iris's parents learned of my family's misfortune. And our betrothal was no more. They found her another suitor. One from beyond the sea. The anger I felt. I thought I'd gone mad. Went to the tavern. Drank around. A second. A broad. Then had another tankard. And then... Then... I asked the wrong bloke for help. What happened then? Ah... What happened then, Witcher, was one big stinking pile of shite. Well, why do you stand there? Do you need something still? Your band. Chosen some interesting specimens. Interested? How so? Common carousers and roughnecks. Every last one. Where'd you dig them up? Some have been with me ages. Others are gathered on the road, and a few found me themselves. They're company for drink and sport, at least. And ever since I began travelling with them, my old enemies have sat quiet as moles. First time I've seen a sabre like that. What's its origin? A fear. It was a gift. Any soft-armed craven can hang a blade from his belt. Prance about feigning danger, but my saber's a promise. If I reach for it, heads will roll. Mere sight of it quells the urge to duel in Shaver's eager to face Algierd von Everek, the infamous outlaw. My medallion seems to think it's magic. <laughs> it thinks, eh? And I think you've never seen a better weapon. Keep wondering how you turned the Ophiri into a beast. More I think about it, more I'm sure it was no run-of-the-mill curse. This professional curiosity, or nosiness, as common as the clap. Desire to improve. Information could prove useful down the line. In the future, you under the delusion you'll complete your tasks, live happily ever after. Remains to be seen. So for now, admit it. The mage helped you, right? I'll give you a hint. You're not the only one to fulfill wishes around here. How Dim transformed the Ophiri? It was your wish? Nay. It was my doing alone. But you're right. It was no ordinary curse. Though I'll say no more. A curse I uttered in a moment of rage. With no thought to it actually taking hold. Third wish. Time you stated it. A moment, Geralt. I must say to something. Then we'll chat. You there. Yank the herring out the barrel.
Come on, none of this dallying. Ah, ah, ah. Now, ready to listen? Or do you still not give two shites about what I've got to say? I'm ready. I'm listening. Good. You'll return to your lord and tell him as follows. His demand was brazen. Hurt me to the core. For I was brought up to respect the sacred law of hospitality. And I shall not bend to an uncouth boar's dictum. Understood. I will pay him a visit shortly to test his willingness to adapt. So you ride off and announce me. And don't spare your horse. Got it? Aye, got it. Give this man a mount and leave him go. Come with you. We must talk outside. The theory believe one should only discuss important matters out of doors with the gods as witnesses. Beryl, what was that about? On the way here, we stopped for nourishment at a tavern belonging to one Lord Dauntless. We enjoyed ourselves as one does at an inn, raucously. Our antics were not to the liking of this Dauntless. Sent a man to warn us that if we were ever to return, we would hang. You burned the inn down? I left ample compensation with the innkeep. But it seems the rapscallion neglected to mention this to his Lord. But that's of little import. What matters is someone called me a horse and threatened to kill me. It was one of those threats that sound like an invitation. I intend to accept it. Return to those parts. Fulfilled two of your wishes. Time I learned the third. Confident, aren't you? Proud, sure of your strengths. Fearless. Third task, if you don't mind. Mutations. They stripped you of emotion. Tell me, have you ever loved? I mean, truly loved. Yeah, I've loved. Can we get to the matter at hand? Perhaps instead we ought to sit down inside. Have a good chat over some fiery water. We'll drink once the job's done. Afraid that's impossible. Succeed and that's the end of me. Fail and you'll not be back. Third wish, still waiting to hear it. Why, aren't you stubborn? Fine. Listen well. I had a wife once. The day I saw her last, I gave her a rose. A violet one. Bring me that bloom. Wouldn't mind reminding myself what it looks like. <sighs> when was that? How long's it been? Flowers wilted and turned to dust by now. You wished to hear a wish. Now you out. Fulfill it. I ride now to visit this Dauntless. But one of my men will remain here. He'll know how to find me. That is, of course, should you succeed. At least you could tell me where your wife is. In my old manor, east of Martin Foy's farmstead. I'd wish you Godspeed, but, well, you understand, I'm sure. Goodbye, Geralt. <laughs> <laughs>